Ice Prince, how you doing, bro? I'm great, man. I'm great. Nice to be sitting next to you again. Nice to be talking to you again. Um, Ice Prince is my name. I'm a rap artist. I'm Nigerian. I'm on Chocolate City. Yes, you are. <laughs> Absolutely, man. Like the yeah. first time we met, you know, we met earlier on in the year. Yeah. You, you know, this was coming off the the, the mega hit, which was Ole Ku. Yeah. Such a fantastic tune. Yeah. It took you to a different level in True. the music stratosphere. You're still basically leaving off, you know, the success of that first yeah. single. Yeah. Now, what happens is once a single comes out like that, everybody is looking forward to the album and the next single. Now, Ole Ku was so big. I personally thought there was no way you could top that. <laughs> now, my partner and boss and cohort said, yes, you could. And you did something which surprised me with the second single, Superstar. Tell me a little bit about that. Man. Um, I, I would be honest with you. I was actually really scared myself. Like, I didn't know I was going to... I was really scared about topping Ole Kool, You know what I'm saying? Because the pressure on me was a lot. People were expecting too much from me. Like, I always say, I think people were expecting me to feature Jesus Christ in my next single. You know what I mean? Like, it was tough for me. But, I mean, I just went into the studio. I, I had to let go of the pressure. I had to let go of the fear. You know, and I, I recorded Superstar. I just, I, I just wanted to do a song called Superstar because at the, at the time I was, I was getting too much love from everywhere I was going to. Up till now, I'm still, getting, I'm, I'm still getting love. But I mean, that was what really inspired the song. Like every country I went to, every state I went to, it was the same love from everybody, the old, the young, you know, I mean, every, the, those in between, it was crazy, you know what I mean? So I just felt I was living the life of a superstar. Mm. And I'm like, that would be the perfect story to tell after an Ole Kool success you know and that's why this superstar now, the, the the video you know the video as well had everything in it you know yeah. it, it showcased yeah. the new lifestyle that you had acquired mm -hmm. based on your status now with the Ole Kool. Yeah. tell us about the video and where you shot it um the video um i wouldn't say i'm exactly excited about the video yeah you know i mean because I, I wanted it to be better than it, it, it is now mm -hmm. i mean but shout out to everybody that likes it mm -hmm. and to those that don't like it i mean shout out to you guys as well you guys are you know, they, they keep giving more push to work harder and work better and stuff. And we shot some of the scenes in London and we shot some of the scenes in Abuja in Nigeria. Yeah. yeah, we came to London for for a show and we, in between time, we just called people, called, got a crew and everybody and we did some shots in London. It was it was exciting, you know, it was exciting. It was shot by my my very my very good friend, Katsunga Duak, very respected individual. And he's the first winner of the Big Brother Nigeria show. Wow. Yeah, he, he finished the Big Brother show, went to America to study in a film school, and he came back to Nigeria, and he's in Chocolate City now. Wow. And so he shot the video, and it was, I think it was good, man. I had fun doing that video, you know what I mean? I had fun doing it. Now, that's good. Before we talk about the album that's coming out pretty soon, yeah. I just wanted to talk about, you know, the camaraderie on Chocolate City. Yeah. Now, Chocolate City is a label right now that, you know, regardless of what anybody else thinks, mm -hmm. is doing it on a, ma on a major, major stage, yeah. you know?